Coach Reeve talked about her not being so tunnel vision on scoring in the restricted area. So look for Nafisa Collier to score in different ways in this ballgame. And that time, her defense helps lead to an offensive opportunity. And Collier calling for the ball the whole way. Juhas found her nicely. And she pushed to get back to play with Sill after having her baby girl. I do remember indeed. There goes three from Kayla McBride. I get it, but I think I'm going with Alyssa. Yeah, Connecticut had missed her last five shots before Thomas hit that one. Ty Harris falls down. Tiffany Mitchell decides to pass out. Came back. Tiffany Mitchell was going to opt for a reverse here. Whoops. Ty Harris loses her footing. I'm just going to say she slipped instead of getting crossed or anything. Great pass out to Kayla McBride. Had an MRI a few days ago. No structural damage, but she's playing through pain. Oh, goodness. Tough catch and finish. That ball had to be in K-Max hands, what, 0.5? Right. She had 14 at the half, I believe, so she's had a terrific second half. Oh, in, out, and in again. Kayla McBride, 26 points. Here's three of them. You got to find her, man. Crowd is ready to explode. And now, the two-man game, McBride getting it over to Collier. McBride didn't make the pass to Juhas, but you switch players, you bring the feet to Collier in, she picks up where she's... On the shot, McBride gets another rebound. Five on four. Got it! Kayla McBride, have yourself an afternoon. That Dijanae Carrington is no longer involved in the play. Five on four, heads up, Dewana Bonners, I don't know what kind of defense that is, but it's not working.